Hey, what's up you guys? It's your girl Cheesecakey. Welcome back to my channel. So, some of you may or may not know that I actually have a pet bunny. Her name is Bijou and I call her B. I got her July of 2017 when she was just five weeks old. So, I realized after the summer has come and gone that I never properly celebrated her one year birthday. So I am making up for that. Right now, I improvised a cake for her, which is just strawberries and cantaloupe, which are her two favorite fruits. And I just kind of cut them up into small pieces for her just to nibble on and it'll be a, a treat for her throughout the week. So because feeding rabbits too many, too many fruits, uh, is very fattening for them. It's not healthy. So before anyone comes after me about that. So yeah, so I have a little cake for her. I have presents. She got two of her presents uh, last week and they're big presents and I couldn't help myself. I love both of them so much that I couldn't wait to give them to her. So she has pretty much marked her territory with those two items and she really loves them. So let me show you what her gifts are. So all of the presents that I got B are all from Petco. They started selling these really cute pusheen themed pet supplies and this is like a big fluffy cat bed that she has pretty much kind of already destroyed but um, it's really cute, she loves it. Um, she likes to, for some reason, there's this removable pillow and she keeps pulling it in and out, but she absolutely loves this. I got her a Pusheen fleece blanket. B absolutely loves little fleece blankets and it's super cute and I know it'll, um, match the bed that I got her. It has this Sherpa on the back side of it. So something else that she can hide under and tear up for her enjoyment. Um, I hear that some bunnies like balls with the bells in them. This is what these look like. So this could either be a good thing or a bad thing for me. I don't know if she's gonna like them. If she doesn't, oh well, but if she does like it, then I might be punishing myself with the noise, but here's what those look like. And B is a little bit of a weirdo. She really loves toilet paper rolls. And she's a pretty territorial bunny. So I wanted to get her a couple cute things that you know she can drag around in her free time and uh, maybe snuggle up to but these are pretty much made for cats uh, they you can put catnip in these but I'm hoping that uh, she'll enjoy tossing these around by their tails bunnies like to toss things with their mouth so I thought this would be a really great uh, stimulating toy for her and she really does love throwing things around. And I also got these, pretty much the same thing. Uh, they're just these little cat toys, it's french fry, and it's a french fry in a soda, cat toy, and hopefully she likes these too. We, uh, we shall see. When B was a little bunny, she had this pineapple in her cage. She doesn't stay in a cage. She's a free roam bunny and loved, loved her pineapple, loved sleeping in it. And this was when she was like a little handful and she still has that pineapple to this day. And she likes to roll it around and drag it around where she uh, plays in the living room. And I thought, you know what, there has to be a pineapple big enough for her now that she's all grown up and I was able to find it on Petco. This is her pineapple house. I am so excited about this gift. It's so freaking cute. She loves it. It's just like 
the adult version of the pineapple she used to sleep in. And I know she's been super happy with this. She loves running in and out of it and pulling her toys in and out of it. And there's a fleece blanket she likes to put in here, but this is her pineapple. For her adult self, it's so cute. It's so well made. I'm so happy with this. B couldn't be more thrilled. And then I have a present that's kind of a present for me. It's a present for her for the sake of me. So I got B a Halloween costume. She was too little for Halloween costumes last year. I got her a pineapple Halloween. It's for, it's, okay, so this is a pineapple Halloween costume for your cat or a dog. I got the smallest size. It's an extra small pineapple set. It comes with this little hat and pretty much a vest. So I think we all know that B is very thick. I'm hoping this fits. Um, I will supervise her wearing this. I, I just want to see her put it on. And she'll probably just tolerate it and not really do anything about it. I also don't know if I'm gonna be able to get the hat on her because she doesn't like anyone touching her chin, but we shall see. She's my little baby. I love her so much. I'm obsessed, like I get it. I'm one of those pet parents. I have evolved. Here is the substitute for a cake. I gave her her favorite fruits and hopefully she likes it. And hopefully she likes the other toys that I got her. I really hope so because I, I really love her. I just want to make her happy. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Beepot. Mommy loves you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Bee. Yeah, it's your favorite food. Mmm, very yummy, huh? So it wasn't the most glamorous birthday, but B is a very sassy, particular little bunny butt. And I was able to catch some footage this week of her playing in her cat bed. So enjoy the footage.
What do you think? What do you think? Me? B? Do you like your pineapple? Yeah. So I hope you found this video to be entertaining. I did want to formally record celebrating Bee's birthday because she is the little light of my life. So make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and watch the curve on your way out.